This America making all kinds of history this year. For the first time, a woman of Indian heritage is wearing the crown, but that's just one of many breakthrough moments for a contest steeped in tradition. ABC's Amy Robach shows us how the pageant that celebrates the girl next door is modernizing its image. All right, America, it comes down to this. There they were, the two finalists, both knowing this night would be like no other in pageant history. We're both so proud. We're making history right here, standing here um, as Asian Americans. But only one could win. Miss America is New York. <laughs> Nina DeVore, aspiring med student and now the first Indian American to win that crown. I've always viewed as Miss America as the girl next door, and the girl next door is evolving as the diversity in America evolves. It's Vanessa Williams. In 1984, Vanessa Williams became the first African American Miss America. But from 1921 until 1970, the pageant was an all white cookie cutter affair. These were the contestants back in 1969. These were the ladies on stage last night. We met Miss Kansas a tattooed army sergeant. You can carry a gun. I can carry a gun. <laughs> Miss Iowa, born without part of her left arm. And Miss Florida, who sported a bedazzled leg brace after taking a spill in an early round of the competition. Oh my God, that really hurt. Some pageant traditions will never change, but some do. Miss New York won with a Bollywood inspired dance. Some ugly comments popped up on Twitter. One read, if you're Miss America, you should have to be American. DeVolere, born in New York, brushed off the smears. As her reign began, tweeting out, she's proud to be America's girl next door. Amy Robach, ABC News, New York.